you know, Haas has been good to us. That's why we've invested in these additional machines. And here we are in the advanced engineering unit of Jota. I'm here with Ryan Goodger, who set up the whole facility. Now, Ryan, before we talk about the machinery, the components that you're making here, which are all absolutely fascinating and really specialist components, tell me more about Jota as a whole. You're, the, there's a, you're a racing team and also an engineering house. The background of Jota, Ryland, um, we're an international racing team that race in the WEC, World Endurance Championship. As you can imagine, running a program like that, you need machining capability. And since we last came here, you bought, you had four, you started with four Haas machines to make these kinds of components. You now have 10. What kind of components are these machines making? So there's a wide variety of components we make on the Hasses. As you know, like you said, when you last come, we have four machines. Um, just the customer demands and the quality we're delivering uh, from these machines. Um, has allowed us to invest in more equipment um, where we bought an additional UMC 750 to support um, an OEM uh, in motorsport and building out, I believe it is 90 car sets of uh, wishbones, damper mounts, etc. Um, we also do quite a lot of work in the development sector in electric motors where we're making some really complex uh, rotors and I mean some of the tolerances on these, we're working down to plus or minus six microns. Could you explain to, to the audience a little bit more about, there's a huge diversity in capacity that you've got? Yeah, so um, really it's functionality or being adaptive to what we need to make. You know, sometimes we might be making a 500 mil diameter uh, workpiece. The next day we could be making a six mil diameter pin to go in one of our race cars. You know, we need to be adaptive and work in different uh, variations of work. Yeah, absolutely. And for, for, the, for those who might look at a Haas machine and think it's more of a, a job shop machine and it's kind of meant to sit in a tool room and mm. not really be right at the forefront of advanced production, clearly that's what you're doing here. What would you say to those those people? Who, who... Yeah, I mean, my comments, um, you know, we've heard this story on the background of Haas, but my comments on that really, I would call this an engineer's machine, you know. The engineers, it's knowing the correct tooling to use, how to manage your machine. I mean, the other beauty of these machines, the interface, you know, we can take a turner who knows the interface of a Haas machine and move him direct to a mill. He's already familiar with all the controls. We're just gonna give him a couple more access to learn, um, which we find works, you know. It's a, it's a quick transition to do things like this. And as a long-standing user of Haas, how do you feel um, confident the reliability of the machines moving forward? Yeah, I mean, we run um, an annual maintenance contract with Haas anyway, so all our machines are serviced every year. You know, we anything wrong with the machine, we get that replaced. And I mean, going back, I think we purchased our first Haas in 2015. It's still going strong, you know, it's running. We operate an 18 hour shift per day in here and that machine's busy for them 18 hours. And what kind of materials? I mean, automotive people generally think it's mostly aluminum components, but are we surprised by the variety of material? Yeah, so, I mean, we, we do cover aluminum. It's motorsport. We want things light, you know, but um, on these hasses, you know, we do a lot of uh, steel, EN24T, uh, we do some ink canals, titaniums. Um, so there is a wide variety. Again, a bit like the parts we make, where we're, one day we're making big to small, it's also the same way with our materials. Obviously, ink canals, people want to shy away a little bit because, yeah, you know, you've got- Yeah, they're tough to machine. Yeah, you've got to monitor that tooling correctly. But yeah, we take on jobs on a wide variety.